everyone so today pink and I are going to tell you guys eight things you should know before adopting a bunny so I have been getting a lot of comments from you guys wanting more bunny care videos and I thought what should I show you guys and then I thought there are so many things that I wish I would have known before adopting Pinky. I don't regret, regret, regret anything though, but I wish I would have known some things before adopting Pinky. So today, I'm going to tell you eight of those things. So let's get started. So the number one thing guys is that bunnies can be very expensive to take care of. For Pinky, we buy hay which is 100 crowns per month. 200 crowns for veggies and herbs and then 100 crowns for extra things like lotion for his calluses and toys so that's 400 crowns per month and then sometimes we need to take him, take him to the ER or vet so that's even more costly so you need to think if having a bunny can fit into your budget as well number two is that you need a lot of time to take care of your bunny so you know, for his daily schedule for Pinky, I certainly feed him water and lotion his calluses for 30 minutes every morning and then feed him his lettuce and herbs for 10 minutes or so and then clean his cage for one hour. And so you need to think if you have the time to take care of bunnies. So if you're a very busy person, bunnies are not for you guys because you need to stay home at least six hours every day to take care of your bunny and to keep him or her happy and healthy da, 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 da. number three is that bunnies are so messy guys there's hay all over our house in our clothes in our hair and pinky likes to chew a lot so there's chew marks all over our clothes as well so yeah definitely think about that because your home is going to get a lot messier when you get a bunny number four is that you need to check if you can find any good quality hay and a rabbit savvy vet near you so if you can find a hay farm near you you should definitely go there because they have the best quality hay and the cheapest hay so definitely check there and also check your local uh, animal hospitals as well Number five is that you need to do so much research guys before adopting a bunny at least a month before and I definitely recommend Rabbit House Society to go there and read all of their pages about bunny illnesses, about what food they can eat and about their personalities. That's so important guys. Number six is the, your future. So think if you're going to move in the future, will your bunny come with you? Because you really should take care of your bunny until the end of their time. Because, yeah, because especially since you're adopting, that's very important. Number seven is that bunnies can be very stressful and tiring. So you should not give them to kids below at least 13. Because having a rabbit is like having a child. And my mom likes to joke sometimes that having a bunny takes a lot more time and effort than having a child. So definitely think about that. So bunnies are not for everyone guys. You need to have so much patience and time for them. Number eight is that the most important part of all. Bunnies are so loving guys. As long as you take care of them, they will, they will give you back so much love and attention as well. And adopting Pinky is one of the best things I have ever done and I definitely re recommend you guys go to your local shelter and volunteer there so you will feel if your if bunnies are really the pet for you okay guys so that is it for the video I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope this helps all of you new bunny mom and dads out there and yeah yeah Pinko yeah and if you guys have any bunny care video requests then definitely definitely leave those down below so we can do those right pinko yes pinky says yes Need more bunny videos pinky says right 
okay so thank you so much guys for watching hope this helped you guys and we will see you next sunday bye pinky Bye everyone! And then also guys, I want to thank you guys so much for 6,000 subscribers. That means so much to me and I'm so happy about it. So thank you so much guys.